off the elbow. Traffic. Lap traffic again. Look at the right place on Conrod. What to yeah, they'll get it done before the kink easily. And the Mark Carr, it's Donaldson behind the wheel there in 17th. Indicates nicely. And that's the right thing to get over oh, this lap, guys. Morrow's closer this lap. Maguna is no, no, coming this time. The moment he starts He's defending, it's down the inside. No. And they're going to call together. Yes, they are. And they're both off. They're both off. Now the 999 goes through. That was absolutely on the cards from the moment that he pulled out. Now, that'll be looked at from race control. New leader as they cross the line will be Maro Engel. <laughs> Teammates a week ago, remember? Teammates. They shared a card of victory at Daytona. Now they crash into each other at Bathurst. So Engel, we'll see it on a replay, no doubt. Yep. But Engel jumped in behind Gunon to make it look like he wasn't going to have a lunch and then stepped out and sent it. Here we go. So just, we need to pick it up earlier He's than there. that. He's not there. He's not there. He's on the send curb. it up over the curb, and that creates contact. I don't think. I don't think that stands. So he's a long way into the corner before contact may goon on. So there's been very little of, of that today. Oh, Let's be I honest. I feel like that's the first one. It's this one here. Engel jinx to make it look like he's not going to pass, then sends it diagonally to the apex. Oh. We know that he has a braking advantage, a grip advantage, but is it enough to get up the inside there on that particular time? Now, as we found out earlier in the week, race stewards, race officials will be looking at telemetry to see if that line into the corner by the leader, Gilles Goudon, is the same as he's been taking every other lap. It was much closer, but is it close enough or is that an overly optimistic lunge down the inside? Well, that's not for us to make no. a and thoroughly predictable message has come up on timing here. Under investigation, incident between cars 999 and 75 at turn 21, which is the chase. So, even with that incident, by the way, Mark Campbell is still 12 seconds behind the leader, but now only five seconds behind second place. So it's split first and second to six and a half seconds, and then it's another five and a half back to third here on the mountain.